Good morning. My name is Greg Bretzing. I'm the special agent in charge of the FBI here in Oregon. For the past month, for the past month, the FBI, along with our partners with the Harney County Sheriff's Office, the Oregon State Police, and the many other state, federal, and local agencies that we have been working with, have had a very deliberate, deliberate and measured response. We have worked diligently to bring the situation at the Malheur National Wildlife Refuge to a peaceful end. But because this is an ongoing investigation, there are many specifics we cannot talk about at this time. There are still people illegally occupying Malheur Refuge at this point. I will say that the armed occupiers have been given ample opportunity to leave the refuge peacefully. They have give, been given opportunities to negotiate. As outsiders to Oregon, they have been given the opportunity to return to their families and to work through the normal legal process to air their grievances. Instead, these individuals have chosen to threaten and intimidate the America they profess to love and through criminal actions bring these consequences upon themselves. Yesterday, the FBI, with our partners, took the first steps to bring this occupation to a conclusion. We worked to ensure that we could do so peacefully and safely out of harm's way of the citizens here in the county, removing the threat of danger from anybody who might be present. We continue to work to empty the refuge of those who continue to illegally occupy uh, the refuge and remove them in the safest way possible. Eight people were arrested and one man died yesterday as we attempted to take him into custody. Because there is an ongoing investigation by the Deschutes County Major Crimes Team on part of the Oregon State Police involving this process, I cannot comment on the details or on the specifics. I would, however, ask for your patience as this shooting investigation goes through this normal outside process at the appropriate time, the medical examiner's office will release the identity of the decedent, and the Oregon State Police will then be able to address the details of the event. Let me be clear. It is the actions and choices of the armed occupiers of the refuge that has led us to where we are today. They had ample opportunity to leave the refuge peacefully. And as the FBI and our partners have clearly demonstrated, actions are not without consequences. Containment roadblocks are now in place around the refuge. The disruption to the good people of Harney County that they've had to endure for the last several months will continue for a while longer. If the people on the refuge want to leave, they are free to do so through the checkpoints where they will be identified. If they have questions or concerns, they can contact the negotiators on the telephone number that has been provided to them. As I conclude, I want to share my promise to the citizens of this county, to the people who live here, who work here, who are raising their families here that we will continue to look for safe, peaceful procedures and how to bring this to a peaceful conclusion. We recognize that the sooner we do so, the sooner this community can begin to heal. Thank you.